Okay guys, it's now another day, Sunday, um, left that panel overnight to dry off for the shower, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to cut out the hole where the toilet uh, cartridge comes out from, and then I'm going to start battening out for the rest of the wall for the shower, so let's get on with it.
Right, okay guys, that's all the framework done now for the toilet and the shower. All I've got to do now is put the ply walls in and then clad it with the plastic. So let's go ahead and have a look at that. There you go guys, framework all built for the toilet. Uh, the shower tray is just in temporarily. Uh, so is the toilet. I'll be taking that out in a minute. So all I've got to do now is put the plywood on for the walls and then put the plastic sheet in on that. And then we're uh, getting pretty close to finishing the shower then. So then it'll just be plumbing it in and putting in the uh, the shower mixer. Okay guys, my next job now is to make a template up for the inner walls of the shower so I can cut my board to the right shape. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that now. Right guys, so I've got a cardboard template in there now. So I'm just going to scribe that out with this tool here. Literally, you put a pencil in there, mark the furthest distance away from the wall, and use this roller to mark it down. Yeah, it's called a scriber. So let's go ahead and try that. Well, okay guys, that marked it out really well. So I'm just gonna cut that out and then try it. Right, okay guys, so I've just cut that out and it's a perfect fit. So let me go ahead and show you. There we go guys, perfect fit all the way down. Yeah, and all the way around, just from using that cheap scriber that I got off Amazon. I will leave a link for that in the description. But that works perfect. So I'm now going to go and transfer that over to my piece of 9mm ply and get that cut out. Right guys, that's the first bit of ply cut out. So let's go ahead and take a look at that. There you go, first bit in. So before I screw that down, what I want to do is on the back here, along here, and a bit down there, see that blue water pipe? I just want to draw some holes in the wood to bring the blue water pipe up and the red one for my uh, shower mixer. So I'm going to do that now before I screw this panel in. Okay guys, that's them holes drilled out for the water pipes. So the next job before I put the panel on is to peel the plastic protective sheeting back a bit on the UPVC sheeting. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do that now.
Okay guys, that's all peeled off, so I'm now gonna go ahead and fix that board to the shower. Okay guys, that's the first one in. So I'm just gonna run the pipes at the back of that one and then we'll start on the second one. Okay guys, so I've temporarily run the uh, pipe work for the back of the shower. So let's go ahead and show you that one. So there we go, there's my hot and cold pipe work. The reds are gonna stop down here because here I'm building a bench seat just under the window and in there I'm gonna put my um, combi boiler for doing the hot water and the heating. So that's more than enough pipe work there for now. So the blue one obviously is gonna run back, goes back behind the toilet, where there's gonna be a T piece in there. So it can go one to the toilet, one for the shower, and then that goes back to your, for your tank. And then obviously I'm gonna to have to put another one in there to come round for the uh, sink. So what I've got to run at the back there now is one red all the way through to back here and leave it coiled up here with the blue as well because then once the bed area is run, uh, built, I will uh, start doing the plumbing for that and the, we'll run across the back of the garage and around to my sink. So what I'm going to do now guys is just run that quickly to that corner down there and then I'm going to start doing this other wall. So I'll catch you in a bit. Right guys, I'm about to scribe out the other wall now. I did try the template for the first one and it's not the same. So I'm just gonna scribe that one out now and get that one cut out. Okay guys, that's all the ply up now for the shower walls. Yep, so next all I've got to do is put the plastic sheeting on. Yeah, on both both walls and on the ceiling. Yep, and then once that's done, then I can build the front for the door. So, there you go guys. Okay guys, that's it for this week. I'll see you next time. Still I run towards the wind and let the child